Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Rockwood number SP1025. This is a version of the SP25 that is custom because it's for a thicker door, and therefore it looks a little different than the standard SP25, but it's otherwise identical. Uh, this is actually a two-piece system with a quarter 20 threaded rod and then the cone head uh, female portion of the assembly to give you an otherwise SP1025 for a three inch thick door. And the rule of thumb with that is the bolt is actually a half of an inch, about a half of an inch longer than the door thickness. So that should, for a two and a half inch thick door, that bolt should measure about three inch. Okay. This is a typical quarter 20 uh, size. Uh, item the, the the machine thread that's on here is quarter twenty. We stock these in lengths from you know inch and three eighths thick doors all the way to probably six inch thick doors in quarter inch increments. So if you were to search the site by SP ten twenty five, you'll certainly find where all of those are uh, in the site. Uh, there are there are there there's some documentation listed down below. Let's switch to the screen view and take a closer look at that. Now this is the item that we're looking at, even though this is an outdated image. By the time you're seeing this video, this will be updated with what the um, with what the custom length version looks like. The point of that is there are uh, some set screws that are listed down below, and it's the SP1065 is the set screw that you'll use to basically tighten the um, handle down onto the cone head portion of the bolt right into this area here. Okay, but there's also a link to the uh, technical drawing of the item, and this is a generic drawing just simply showing you uh, what an SP1025 looks like in different lengths for different door thicknesses. The only reason this is important is because the logic stays the same. This one here would be for an inch and three quarter thick door because it's two and a quarter long. There's also a link to the product book catalog, and that will show you some other typical uh, bolts that are immediately in this through bolt series. So SP1025 would be the quarter 20 version. The SP1056 would be the 5 16th 18 version, simply a thicker bolt. Okay. So we're looking at the SP1025 and these custom sizes, basically what they're doing is taking threaded rod and then adding an SP1027. And then you have the uh, SP1025 for a different door thickness. Your uh, set screws and as I'm going through uh, this video I realize there's a typo here uh, a little bit of a, a little bit of a uh, an unintentional error the SP 1026 set screw is the standard set screw and we have this backwards the SP 1026 is the most common the SP 1065 is only used with these uh, smaller poles. So it's definitely the SP1026 that you would want to order if you need set screws as well. Okay, So sorry about that confusion. Um, the double cone head bolts are available here as well. Other parts that you can see. There is finally a link below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can review not only all of the Rockwood products that we sell, but also a link to the manufacturer's website, as well as a link to the full product catalog that's here. That's going to go over all of their trim and auxiliary hardware, like their, um, you know, obviously their standard uh, push uh, hardware, pull hardware. Uh, they will have a complete offering of flat goods like kick plates, uh, door stops, obviously, and a variety of other very high quality trim and auxiliary material. And this catalog is an indispensable resource when it comes to the core product line of exactly what it is that Rockwood does. They also have their RM series of architectural door pulls, which is here. And that's 100 plus pages of custom door pulls that are available in you know, a near limitless amount of variety and options. So if you're looking for a custom door pull, that would be the document, architectural door pulls right there. Let's wrap up this video on camera.
In conclusion, it's not unusual to have uh, odd door thicknesses. Um, you know, a lot of people are putting back-to-back -back poles on. The application, believe it or not, is acoustical doors, meaning they build doors to retard the transmission of sound, and those doors end up being quite thick. Well, they put pole handles on both sides of those doors, and I have a client who regularly orders the one, I think it's the 110 pole handle from Rockwood from us, always for odd door thickness, three, three and a quarter thick, things of that nature. And I don't know why this client needs, you know, a, uh, a bolt for a, a thicker door, two and a half inch. You know, it could be an existing door that they've got a single broken bolt. Well, here it is. Any questions on the SP1025 or any other Rockwood product, please feel free to reach out to us. And thank you.